It's Wednesday. Good morning, world. I'm really tired. It's like 11. It's not early enough for me to be this tired and not be a disgrace. But we went to sleep at like 4. Is that reasonable? It's kind of reasonable, right? I have to go to work to get Rose delivery in because she is working two jobs at the moment before she can leave her other one. And someone has to be there for it. So that's what I'm going to do. Also, I think Keelan and Sarah are here. Chip my tooth on a chocolate penis before. <laughs> you did chip your tooth on a yeah, chocolate penis before. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to my job at the aquarium now. I always accidentally end up wearing this combo. I feel like I look like at an aquarium. <laughs> Say hi to the fishies. God, I look so tired. Why is there no solution to puffy face? Why, why have we not, as a society, come up with something to fix that? We live in a society. Uh, uh, team Koch and Team Melon, and our Team Koch, story va, story va. Good story. It is Wednesday, the 30th of October, 2019. My name is Kim. I will be your between for the next Wednesday. I'm here for roast delivery, because our manager is away at the moment. And I should probably do my own order. I've only got one job at the moment, which is lovely. Just one job. You could have five or six jobs. Or just one. I've been deciding for a while if I want to do this because I think in my head it's a lot more stressful than it's actually going to be. And in true me style, I haven't charged my cameras, haven't charged any of the batteries, haven't formatted any cards in preparation, and I have literally no idea what I'm doing. Come on, delivery. So there you are. Came right, let's start with three. So Dan will take the one down. Okay. That took a little bit longer than expected. But it is two o'clock. I am meeting Matt for a coffee of sorts. We don't have to drink coffee. There's no legal obligation to drink coffee at a coffee date, is there? Today is the 30th of October, and therefore, tomorrow, we are having a Halloween party. I'm rubbish at Halloween costume. By the time I decide on something, Halloween is the next day. The only way that I can do my costume is by like not getting the chance to shop around and like spending loads of money that I don't want to have to spend. Uh, and I think we're kind of in that situation again. Shaney went to the dentist, didn't we? I got a little hat for my tooth. Can I see the hat for your Is it this big one? Yeah, yeah a big white wow. one. Yeah. She's thick. She is thick. Shane's got a bat for his Halloween costume. Where are you, Shaney? I'm in the delivery room. You ready? Yes. Go. <laughs> hey, roll! <laughs> oh! It almost went in the toilet. If the lid hadn't been closed, it would have gone in. going to meet Matt. Along this road by the river, every day at like 5pm, in the distance you can hear loads of cars honking their horns because the swans in packs cross the road and then they stay still right on the zebra crossing. But like, swans don't know what honking your horn means, they're not going to respond to that. Hi! Hi It is very pretty. Have you ever been to my house? No. Do you I think so. Anyway. Now I'm back, back on the flag. Don't look surprised that I'm still singing, cause you know I have a neck and you believe what you see. 
you think I've gotten sexy? Oh, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> brought that over just to give him a quick house tour. Now, Ro has finished work, the others have gone to meet her at the bay, so I'm going to join them. Um, oh, no. In the same aisle Thank you. Um, oh, yeah. Well, these are interesting. I like the crunch. Yeah. Shane and Ro are trying to help me plan a costume for tomorrow because I don't got one yet. <laughs> me and Diane Holmes from Torchwood for the 0.001% of people who know her. She's fucking fit, is what she is. <laughs> she is really fit. She is fit. Yeah, fair Maybe I too can be fit. Probably not. No. What? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know because I'm overwhelmed and I'm I have two jobs. So thinking about those jobs is a job in itself. So actually, I'm doing three jobs. Do we know anyone with a projector? And we could project our feelings. Yeah, yeah. woman. Uh, that was really good. She's really good. She, <laughs> she is, is really, really good. good. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna plan this party so far in ahead that we can't possibly fuck it up. <laughs> like it was the most time I ever had between making an event page on Facebook and the actual party. It was like six weeks, and somehow I blinked, and now it's the night before, and we don't even we don't even have a fake spider. Should we make a list? I need to go to bed. <laughs> okay. Keep <laughs> getting really into conversation, and then as soon as something's requested of you, like no, I just go. <laughs> Did it. End of day. I think I've settled on Diane Holmes from Torchwood as a costume. I really don't like the idea of just like buying stuff just for a costume and wearing it once. It's such a waste of clothes and a waste of money and so like wasteful generally. But with this one I really like the style of the jacket anyway. I always need a shirt and I've been meaning to buy some trousers that are just like trousers. So I think it's killing two birds. But for now, it is bedtime. <laughs> Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Got to get a costume. It's Halloween today and I got a good costume. That's okay, you've got ADHD. Yeah, I've got ADHD. I forgot that it's half term, so the town is really, really busy. We shopped a lot. I desperately scrambled to find some stuff that vaguely looks like what Diane Holmes is, which is a pilot from the 50s, and I think it'll pass.
left the club, as I was leaving, I was like, oh, six, amazing that it's not raining too much. But now that I've walked through it for about 15 minutes, I'm like, oh, maybe it is raining that much. Happy Halloween. Good morning, everyone. I say morning, it is one-ish p.m. Two. 2 p.m. Everyone's feeling a little bit delicate. I have got a spot on my head that's so big it's like casting a shadow, but we're all going for a roast to forget about that. Hola, everybody. Oh, hello. hello. <laughs> we had a lovely night. Elliot had a lovely night for about two hours. <laughs> you okay? Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> Do you not remember the person that you were kissing for six hours? <laughs> So, my yellow chair is my most prized possession, as I've said before. So last night, in, like, over-caution, I cling filmed it like some kind of 80s housewife. But it worked out well, because poor little Elliot, who needed a lot of looking after last night, he's a lot younger than us, we were all gathered around making sure he was okay, um, and he did a bit of a sick, but he did it in the cling film chair, so who's the real loser now? Probably Elliot, actually, isn't it? We got this letter that says, Important information about your conservatory. <laughs> Finally. I have been wondering. So my first job was working for the council's translation department uh, for Swansea and Albert. And until 1993, because the Welsh Language Act didn't exist, there was only one man who worked in that entire department. Wow. Who was my now stepdad. <laughs> Occasionally he would come in where there were like 12 to 14 of us to tediously make fun of us for oh, needing 12 people to do a job. <laughs> that he did on his own. That's funny. <laughs> like no one really knows the figure, but I think the last time someone tried properly counting how many comedians there are in the country, it was about 8,000. Wow. I don't think Piwa amateur counts, so I don't think... Piwa. I love oh, I love that. <laughs> Piwa. Correct. Oh, flash, ready? Yeah. Nice. That's fun. Rose first shift running the kitchen where we work. Well, first, like, real. First proper shift, yeah. How are you feeling? Nervous. The yeah. jelly beans tin. The jelly beans tin. What, what's our team today? Dan, Harvey, Jay, Denise, oh. Bernie, oh. and Tess. This is a lovely team. I nearly cried as the word Jay. That's cool. <laughs> With Looks like a tombola. <laughs> is that what I'm thinking of? Like a bingo, like... <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> Look at that. Oh, Freezer. And when I did that, I just put all the ice creams in a bin bag and put them in the chest freezer. And then in a rush, when I was doing those delivery, I just put the bin bag in the ice cream freezer. So now there's just a bin bag in there and I keep forgetting to take them out. And people are looking at them like, oh, can I get it? Oh, have you got ice cream? And I'm like, yes, it's in the bin bag. I'm sorry. If you're watching this, I'm dead. <laughs> Please tell Alan that I don't like her. Sam's a moron. Jose's a twat. What's behind door number one? <laughs> So I move my fringe to the other side to cover it up. <laughs> there we go. Flawless. Yeah, no one will know. I like your scarf, Adam. Where'd you get it? Thank you. Alice Evans knitted it. That's pretty cool. It's the pansexual colours. And the pink is so vivid. It's so, so vivid. Oh, vivid. Nice word. Thank you. Do you like my hair? I always have it like this. <laughs> so I don't I've never seen you not like that. <laughs> yeah. It's like... Thank you. Being a friend. Thank you. Come on. What does problematic Beyonce say today? <laughs> she just doesn't find women funny. <laughs> right, do you want some wasted bramble? Yeah. <laughs> just living your life and there's just a big willy. I'm gonna get a floor plan up and design the office. <laughs> See what I mean? This is why I have to go in segments. Measuring it in segments is about as effective as being like one. No, because I'm making them all. <laughs> I'm having fun. I'm 
Okay. So you don't want me to hold it? No. Okay. Oh, I was gonna say, sorry. You go ahead. This desk is five foot wide. Measuring in feet? Yeah. How else? Metric. Because of RJ's tidying, it doesn't look like we had a party last I night. I know, I sent him a message to say thank you. Yeah, that was really kind of... What have we got on our haul, though? This vodka that I've never been able to pronounce the name. This fancy looking gin. Almost a full bottle of honey jar. Joe and Tess's white rum that they might want back. I can't even make it around. Well, to be fair, they're too big for you. Yeah, but I don't understand. Please don't hurt yourself. I know, I'm really scared. Your ankles are too weak for this. This is why we need, we need to have the parties. Because yeah. Because we can always leave their shit behind and it's great. And then we never have to buy anything for the next party because we just True. view it from the stuff they left behind. Yeah. Through a hole with a blindfold. Well, I don't think they've got blindfolds. I think they're like, you know what, if you've been like, you know, if you're in isolation in school, <laughs> Put into yeah, I a little, do. like, a you know, the little seg, yeah, a little cubby, yeah. and they've got a little like, cubby. <laughs> they've got like a little hatch, like you're in prison. That drinks cabinet is one of the best things that was already here when we moved in. Yeah. I would order cookies and not. <gasps> I'm having one, I'm gonna microwave it. Oh, sorry, Shannon, I didn't see you there. difficult than it should have been. I find it really hard with my ADHD to find anything in a supermarket. It took me 20 solid minutes to find creme fraiche. I looked by the yogurts and the creams and the stuff that it should be next to and I couldn't see it and then I went round and then I went down that aisle about three times looking pretty much at the spot that it was in before I saw it and then the last time I looked one shelf up and it was there and I even had a picture of exactly what the little pot looked like for reference but I just, I just couldn't see it. I also don't have that natural sense of where stuff would be like I don't think in the correct way for it. I was looking for some specific pizza bases and in my head they should be maybe by the bread so then when they weren't by the bread I can't I can't like implement a second, a plan B. When something's not where I expect it to be, it's like my brain doesn't believe it, so I just go round and round looking at the same spot. It's like my brain thinks, oh, and maybe it'll be there this time, but it's not gonna be there this time. So I was pretty useless for this task, and I ended up messaging Beachy, and she had to like guide me around where everything is in the supermarket, and that's why I don't like going to supermarkets. Hey, thank you so much. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'll see you up there. Okay, thank you. See you in a bit. The last seven weeks yeah. that I work, guess how has the, the conversation has been? <laughs> Just right. Every customer. <laughs> yeah, it's unbelievable. I hate cars. <laughs> if your job relies on the car, the only way I can sort of give you an idea how bad it is. I don't think you're old enough that you are the most nightmare boyfriend or girlfriend, yeah? <laughs> Have you ever had a guy or a girl that you think, my God, you're impossible? Time that by 10, and that's what it's like having a car. <laughs> and you spend all your money on them. Yeah, all your money on them, and they're never happy, you know? <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh, Bernie. Yeah. Step aside. Okay. That's how I do it. Yeah. Okay. Hi. Hello. How you doing? Good. I was like, cool. Four student cards, please. And she was like, oh no, I'm the new student. Oh no, but I bought them for my friends. 
Yes. Like, right, so... Are your friends too? No, because they didn't pay me for it. She was definitely like a sharing. She immediately went, I want a refund! And I'm like, wow. right, okay, no. I want a refund, I don't want what I paid for. Yeah. <laughs> Here's my manager of email, he'd be more than happy to speak to you, because you have literally no ground. We did literally nothing. Here's my manager's email, he'd be more than happy to back me up. Yeah. <laughs> you fucking idiot. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Welcome. Just for GDPR purposes, we are recording this. <laughs> <laughs> No, some twat trying to hide these in their coat and they were going out for a cigarette. <laughs> How? Like in their arms? I, that's a very good question. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to both! Hey! 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 <laughs> 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 For me, a bucket is more like cylindrical and taller, and a basin is more square and shorter. <laughs> no, it is a bucket. It's a basin. No, it's definitely a bucket. No, because a bucket has like a handle. No, it's just like a square bucket. No, but like it doesn't serve the whole purpose of a bucket. <laughs> Today, problematic Beyonce says, Jose for floor manager. That's the worst one yet. And that being a staff joke is all you need to know about Jose. <laughs> this piece of cucumber has been there for... How long do we think it's been there for? Like 10 years? I didn't even know it was a piece of cucumber until you pointed it out. Like, yeah, it, it's not the correct colour anymore. No. It's about 9am. Somewhere in the middle of editing this, the source files got messed up and half the project is playing the video of one source file with the audio of another source file and then the original one comes back in and everything's been messed up but at the moment everything's so confusing it's looking like I'm gonna have to like sync it one way, export it, then sync it the other way, export it and then realign them in a separate project even though that's a really convoluted way of doing it because the actual source file is damaged there's a lot going on Gonna take these up to the gang. Morning. Morning. I got you this tea. Thank you. I got you a tea. Thank you. This bit of moss on my car is absolutely thriving. Look at her. <sighs> so proud of her. And there's a little bit here, a little bit here. I lived home and I've just finished my Bratislava video, so I'm gonna scratch it off on the map. Now I'm back off to work. I'm working the shift on my own today, which means it's just me for cleaner. Just poor little old me. Rose made me a nice cup of tea though. Made with love. I did as well. Really early. I did not get fired today. Everyone's been brave today. Beachy brave, Ro brave. Me brave. There are many, many ladies of the night near where we live. In the past few weeks have become a lot more confident in the way that they walk to a vehicle and there's a corner that we have to turn up to get to our house and I start indicating and two of them will start walking towards and I'm like, no, no, Thank you, miss. Oh, thanks very much. We're relaxing after work. Harry, 
even in the wizarding world. <laughs> Hearing voices is not a good thing. Even in the wizarding world. They gave her acting lessons, but they only gave acting lessons to her eyebrows. Yes. <laughs> yeah. And he clearly got the same. He clearly got the same. Changed the turn at all. Mm. Like, mm. Beachy came Thursday with us, and then she did a whole shift at work, and it's now half three. When's your bus that you're leaving to get? In 55 minutes. In 55 minutes. Yeah. The bravest person on earth. I'm going to bed. <laughs> You feel like I'm such a weak ass bitch. You are a weak ass bitch. Send this uh, first class recording as well, please. Some people came into where we work to do a recce for some TV thing? I don't know. Something to do with filming. And they only took about 15 minutes and now they're gone, so now the only thing that's holding me back from going home is drinking this tea. Six launched a targeted operation against that compound. They did a lot of shooting. <laughs> if you're a normal person, say knock knock. Man, <laughs> He's the president. The they killed Osama bin Laden and took custody of his body. He died like a dog. <laughs> may God bless you, and may God bless the United States of America. And I'm writing a book. <laughs> okay. Shane just told me that apparently famous birthdays, which first of all, <laughs> what am I doing on there? Um, Sean's on it as well. Yeah, but Sean is kind of famous now. Famous birthday says I'm English. I also heard your birthday wrong. I've messaged them like three times. I think they changed your birthday. <laughs> YouTube star. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. I'm sorry, I was just looking at your other tabs. Leek soup recipe. No. Mushroom soup recipe. <laughs> this is specifically teaching me how to <laughs> cut a leek. I'll show you Isn't that. that my tea? I just microwaved it. <laughs> You're just drinking yes. it. Thank you. <laughs> the absolute cheek of that guy. Was it on question time? This might be a crazy idea. Yeah. But I was just thinking maybe Ireland should be a united island. You're like, oh, really? oh is it? If oh. only the Irish had thought of that themselves. I grew up with um, a proper oven and you had to light a match and lean into the back to light it at the back oh yeah like yeah right an, an oven you know a real yeah. oven so obviously there's no glass on the door you can't look at what you're cooking i'd go around someone else's house and i was like where's the fire yeah <laughs> what's going on but yeah. now i'm just like oh there's a red hot bar what does that mean <laughs> you got like the tea towel over your shoulder as well yeah come on honey time. come on do we have a label not count spatula Proper cozy soup. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I love you. I love you. We're gonna get through the sad winter together. Yeah. Aren't we? Oh, I'm sorry, I pulled your hair. Oh, you didn't. My big head. I, I, I didn't notice, and also I ate some of your hair. Oh, cool. And pulled oh, it I have from not your head, it I think. Today. <laughs> oh, God, it's awful. Come on, come on in. What's that? I can't. Jay! <laughs> 1,200 tons of durum wheat is delivered here every day. We were shaking, helps to keep the pasta moving and stops it from sticking together. <laughs> so, Pele is tagging me, Sally. Sounds pretty satisfying. Yeah, I love a good funnel. Mm. I'm sorry, guys. Guys, I'm sorry. Guys, guys, I'm so sorry. They made it that far and they didn't even have you. <laughs> Like, yeah, they didn't need me. I saw the success. I didn't want to cheapen it. Mm. Night night, Shani. She makes me so angry. Okay, ready? This is the longer version. It's horrific. Instead of apologizing like a sick okay, swamping in the middle of the road is gonna help? You being a bitch is gonna help? I would say. I don't know, calm down. She's so calm. Calm down. Like the bitch ass hoe. Sorry. Bitch me calling you a bitch. Your window's open. They can't hear me because they're listening to kids' thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Soft stick. Calm down. The guys who made the food had mixed up 
which one had the allergen or whatever. So I was getting it remade, so it didn't kill him. Yeah. But he was then telling me it wasn't a big deal. Yeah. But clearly, well, like, then why did you ask for it? Because I just don't want you to die. Yeah. What are they doing? They were, oh, and they got him. It's, they're so monkey. You love them. I love the ducks. I love the ducks. What did you need help with? Drilling in my bedroom. Ooh. We're drilling in my bedroom. Do you want to grab the drill? Yes. If we do this one first, mm -hmm. and then we accidentally do the second one wrong, then we can loosen this one and change the position of this one, which I think will be useful. Maybe a tiny bit down. Thanks, Tim. Look, that feels secure. I feel secure with you. A little while ago I've got this back on. This, ah, this is my family's Yamaha keyboard. They kind of got tucked away in the attic while I was living in the attic, so I got it out and kind of claimed it as my own because no one else seemed to want it. My sisters live not in this country. It's in really good working condition except for these keys. It's got very flimsy key action. It's very much like a little synthy type of keyboard. The main issue with this one is that you can't get any dynamics into a song, it's just sort of like whoop whoop whoop. But I mean they're physically still there, so it's fine. My plan is that by using this and with my existing Welsh ability and watching Welsh telly, I, I can bring myself up to a conversational level. All those years of learning Welsh, I can just tell you that Dwi moin hai chwarae peldroid en a ganolfyn hamdhyn gyda fyrindiau bob dydd gwener, which is not true, but how are you to know? It is 11.59pm on Tuesday the 5th of November 2019. We are half a minute away from the end of this Between Wednesdays. Oh, there we go. That's it. That's it. Thank you, everyone. Goodbye and good night.